good day scratch friends i am back and today we're going to do part four where we have the next level of our scratch program so start by visiting scratch if you haven't completed the rest of the lessons i'll have a link up here in the top corner so that you can get to the former lessons they're all pretty fast and fun so that you can get through this quick and have skills to make your own cool creations once you've learned it Alrighty, friends once you get into scratch click the my stuff option so we can find our scratch 3.0 remember there's the v3 which is exactly like what i've been teaching you and then you could also have your fun one that you're going crazy with first start with mine by clicking see inside and then if we review quickly we have created a game where when you click the flag and move the arrows if you drive through without touching the yellow edges it tells you that you won if you miss, then it does the, you go back and start over and says try again. Right now we're going to add a level 2 and let me show you how easy it is to make that happen. Alright friends, so let's get it ready to do level 2 by clicking start and crashing so it goes back to the main start location. We want to make sure we have that. Once we do, go to our sprite and choose its costumes. This is called level one. If you didn't name yours level one, name it level one right now. And then right click on it and choose duplicate. That's really cool because it makes it level two. If you don't have level two, you can name it level two. The other nice thing is that it keeps the fill color from the 17 that we had before or whatever number you picked. I'm gonna get mine back to 17 so it stays consistent and that way I'm ready to use it again. We want to get rid of what is on this screen, so all we do is make sure we've got level 2 clicked, click on the select tool, and choose delete so that our old track is gone. We want to use the brush once again to make a new track. I'm going to make my new track a little bit fancier. I'm making sure that I'm above my spaceship, and this time I'm going to go up. So that line is going to be fine, and then I'm going to go over, and what I'm doing is I'm drawing here, and I'm looking over here to make sure it works. This time it's gonna be more like an M. So you can see here I've got my second line of my M and this way the ship lands in this area and then moves to these areas. And I'm gonna come down. I'm gonna make it come across. There's some up. I'm gonna put a silly jag in it. I'm gonna make it come over and then finally make it end at our earth i don't want it to be super evil because this is only level two but this does make it so that our project can work switching so these show up at the right time is amazingly easy simply move to your code and go to your events and we need to give it a when i receive we want to bring out the when i receive start and when this sprite receives start we want it to show costume level one. We need a second message and that is gonna be switched to level two. So when you bring out the when I receive, type new message and then choose level two. I already made the word level two so mine is already there. And then it simply switches to costume two or level two when it receives it. That's how easy it is to switch from course to course. Now let's move back to our Earth. And on our Earth tab, we used to broadcast start. Now we need to broadcast level two when the Earth is touched. And the last piece is to go to our spaceship. And we need to bring out its own when I receive level two. Make sure you switch to the level two choice. I'm going to go to looks and I'm going to make my spaceship a different size just because that's kind of a cool option. And you could have made your course too difficult for level two. I'm going to real quickly get another go to just so I'm sure that it's in a safe spot. And then we need to bring out a forever and code it for its touching color. My favorite way is to grab this word if and break it apart. Right click on the word if and duplicate it. Put that back underneath where it belongs. Bring the new <laughs> bring the new one in. It helps if you grab them in the right spot and put it where it belongs. 
and then I'm gonna make sure my touching color is perfect by switching to sprite 2 by just clicking on its level 2 and then going back to the costume code noting that I have to click code and then when we hit the paintbrush and do the little sensor you can zoom in and make sure that you're on the correct yellow I'm gonna switch back manually actually I'm gonna hit stop and I'm gonna hit start and you'll notice that it goes to sprite 1 let's zoom across and see if we can actually win so far so good let's see if I can not get silly there's that awesome cheer and check it out it instantly takes us back for level 2 where we can try and be successful as well let's test and see the collision notice it took me back and started over and bam we have got a two level game in no time friends if you enjoyed this at all please hammer that like button if you haven't subscribed yet what are you waiting for mash that subscribe button if you got a question or a comment or even a suggestion add it down below and if you want to be the first to know when i make a new movie hit that notification bell thanks for watching have a great day friends